Empty coffins representing the Ethiopian victims of last week's Ethiopia Airlines plane crash have been buried in the capital, Addis Ababa. None of the bodies has yet been formally identified because of the impact when the Boeing 737 MAX 8 aircraft crashed shortly after it took off for the Kenyan capital, Nairobi, killing all 157 people on board. Some relatives were overcome with grief while others threw themselves on the red coffins draped with the Ethiopian flag at the Holy Trinity Cathedral in Addis Ababa. Some family members have been given charred earth from the crash site to help remember their loved ones. Families have been told it could take up to six months to identify the remains. Meanwhile, flight data from the Ethiopian Airlines disaster a week ago suggest clear similarities with the crash off Indonesia last October, Ethiopia's transport minister has said. Airlines around the world have grounded their Boeing 737 MAX 8 aircraft following the second fatal crash involving the plane in five months. The BBC's Kolkid Nyibeldal in Addis Ababa says the temporary death certificates were issued ahead of Sunday's funeral service. There was also a ceremony for Ethiopian Airlines staff at the city's Bowl International Airport to pay their respects to the eight crew on board Flight 302, Nairobi. In Nairobi, relatives of some of the 36 Kenyan victims, as well as diplomats from some of the more than 30 countries whose citizens died in the crash, gathered to pay their respects at an Ethiopian Orthodox church in the city. The BBC's Ferdinand Omendi, who was at the ceremony, says there was a somber mood as candles were lit and prayers held. Many worshippers were wearing white from head to toe. Kenya's transport minister James Makaria told worshippers that bereaved families had taken bags of earth from the crash site as a memory of their loved ones. The Ethiopian government allowed them to take samples of the earth where they lost their loved ones and bring that soil home, he said. But some relatives told our reporter that they would only get full closure when at least some body parts were handed over to them.